expecting cooler conditions today. Already breaking into the low 50s for some of us, so as you step out for lunch, definitely needing the sunglasses, but also the extra layer. If you're heading to the Washington Wizards game tonight, notice those temperatures falling into the upper 30s as we go through about 9, 10 o'clock, and we will stay dry through the overnight hours. A look at our weekend forecast. Some earlier showers on Saturday morning, a break for the afternoon, and then some steadier rainfall late Saturday night. Also, notice our daytime high, upper 50s, so we're warm again tomorrow, and then a temp Temperature crash on Sunday. We're back in the upper 40s and also expecting some gusty winds, but at least the sunshine will return. A look to future cast. This is a look at 8 a.m. tomorrow morning, mainly some showers to the northwest of the district. So as we play this forward through about lunchtime, possibly getting into Silver Spring, uh, back towards Gaithersburg and Baltimore. Silver Spring, remember the Thanksgiving parade from 10 to noon, so take the rain gear if you are going to be heading out to that event. Notice we catch a break through uh, the evening hours. Next chance for some showers. This is with the cold front moving through late Saturday night. So this is a look at midnight and you notice the shades of yellow and also orange. So some pockets of steadier rainfall. Also behind this front, temperatures come crashing down, but the winds pick up. This is a look at our future wind gusts uh, through Saturday morning, or excuse me, Sunday morning, I should say. We're approaching mid-30s to low 40s, so certainly very windy. There's no wind advisory in effect yet, but I would likely expect that as we go through the rest of the weekend. Here's a look at your Thanksgiving Day forecast. Some sunshine, dry skies, and temperature right around 50 degrees. Area of high pressure sets up, so we are looking at a dry forecast. A quick look at your extended forecast into next week will be cool on Sunday and Monday, but into next week, temperatures should get back into the mid 50s on Tuesday, and it looks like we stay dry. Adriana, back to you. All right, thanks so much, Molly. Well, happening tonight, 2020 is following the inspiring story of Nathaniel Newman. The 13 year old was born with a rare condition known as Trutcher Collins that causes malformations of the face. His condition is strikingly similar to the character in the book Wander. For more on this story, we are joined now by by ABC's Elizabeth Vargas, who followed Nathaniel for nearly three years. Elizabeth, great to have you on the show this afternoon. Uh, can you tell people about Nathaniel's spirit and the kind of little boy that he is? He's an amazing boy. It's incredible uh, the courage that he has to go through life. Uh, he was born uh, just like the character in the book Wonder. In fact, the, the parallels between Nathaniel's life and the character Augie Pullman, the lead character in the book Wonder, are, are strikingly similar to the point of being sort of cos a cosmic coincidence since the author had never met Nathaniel or his family. Nathaniel, as you said, was born with Treacher Collins, a severe facial deformity. There's nothing that can be done to fix it. Um, he has needed, however, 60 surgeries to be able to breathe properly, swallow, eat, hear, um, function properly. But other than that, he's a completely normal little boy. Of course, the world does not react to him like that. Um, tonight, we take you inside uh, the story of his family, uh, the courage these parents have. We all have, to, it's all a leap of faith that we as parents, as we send our children just even to kindergarten, um, out into the world without us there hovering over them to protect them. And we hope and trust the world will be a kind place to them. Well, these parents obviously pray a little harder for that because the world is often not kind to people who look different. Tonight, though, I think you'll get to meet a, a little boy and his parents and his brother. Well, that will give you a whole different perspective. It's a really a show for the whole family, especially people who've read the book Wonder, which is a worldwide sensation. And I was going to ask you if this is something that the family should watch together. It sounds like it is. What do you want kids to take away from this inspiring story? Listen, we have found out through all of the stories and reporting that we do, and even just anecdotally, we all know that when you know somebody, when you uh, can empathize with somebody, you, you will be kinder to them. It's much easier to vilify people or to be cruel or cutting uh, when you don't know somebody. And tonight, by meeting Nathaniel, you will get a, a feeling for what it is like to be him, what it is like to be a little boy who looks this radically different. Um, and what it is like to be his m mother and father, uh, and even little brother, who all have their roles to play. Uh, obviously, the parents' enormous roles. Um, they really, you know, their entire lives changed the nanosecond that Nathaniel Newman was born, changed in a way they never could have anticipated. And I think that, you know, that's something a lot of parents may be faced with at some point. And I think we can all use a little bit of, a little dose of empathy and a little lesson in being kind, uh, especially right now, given the current temperature of the times. 
All right, Elizabeth Vargas, thank you so much for your time. You can catch that 2020 story tonight right here, 10 o'clock on ABC7. Stay with us. We'll be right back. I fell in love with dancing when I was a little girl. Recently, I got a chance to rediscover how fun it is to keep on dancing. Now you can see who keeps on dancing by entering for a chance to go to ABC's Dancing with the Stars at KeepDancingNow.com. Sponsored by Mir Betrick. Fall on Live is jam-packed with stars. That sounds like heaven. So many stars. It's going to be about a thousand people. We could go on and on. Great day, start one. We face at nine on ABC7. We're all in this together. This is all about your injury. All you gotta do is sign. The offer's more than fair. All you have to do is sign. You call the lawyer. Mike Slocum Law. I hate